What's up everybody, Silver here with another Halo Master Chief Collection Achievement Guide. This time we're doing Bros to the Close, which is in Halo 4, complete infinity without one preventable marine death on Heroic or Legendary. So start up this level, Infinity, on Heroic, Rally Point Bravo, you don't have to start in the beginning. Kill these crawlers as fast as you can. Exchange your assault rifle for a DMR, so you have a DMR and a pistol. And you want to take out these enemies as quickly as possible. You have two marines right at the start that you need to save from dying. Whoa, boy. Oh, that guy was charging me via teleportation, and I stunned him with a frag before that even happened. That was pretty sweet. But kill that watcher as quickly as possible as well, because obviously he throws grenades. Or, he does not throw grenades, but he prevents you from throwing grenades, because he'll just throw them right back at you. So that allows us to throw grenades at those hunter, or not hunters, Promethean Knights. And we're ready to go to the next section, so fill up on DMR. I'm ready to go. I got an auto sentry for a uh, armor ability. I got my DMR and light rifle filled up. You want to go up here, jump up here, and then jump up here. And that will keep these two marines here, actually, for the next battle. So you won't have to, so you won't have to worry about them. And it'll actually uh, disallow a spawning knight. Normally, a knight spawns where I just was, but uh, that doesn't happen if you do that jump that I just did. So go over here, and you want to kill all these enemies as quickly as possible. There's going to be a bunch of crawlers. You see I deployed my auto sentry to distract some people and damage some people. It couldn't hurt. And then once you kill enough crawlers, this knight will start coming down. Usually he does not teleport, lunge, or whatever that's called from that far away. That was kind of weird. But we'll take it. I still have all four of my marines alive, so you just consistently want to do a head count. Just make sure you have all of them alive, and if not, just revert to your last checkpoint and try again. So, I actually luckily got this on my first try in this run-through. I've had other run-throughs where I did not get it, so. Um, yeah, so I think I've killed everybody here, except for one crawler is up there. So I'm going to exchange my light rifle for a rail gun, and there's the one crawler right there. Just take him out with a DMR. And we got our four marines. Unfortunately, we have to move up. Uh, to spawn the other enemies, which causes our marines to move up. So, get your railgun ready and railgun that watcher. And DMR this watcher. And that will prevent the watchers from spawning the focus turrets. And those focus turrets are key because they actually destroy your marines. So, you really want to get those uh, watchers to die quickly so they don't spawn those guys in. And then you could railgun the knight. It takes one hit with the railgun on heroic. So, that's pretty fortunate. And then just headshot all the crawlers. One more uh, knight will spawn in. And I was checking my radar to see if I had four contacts, if all my marines were still alive. So I choked and missed that shot. Uh, but I got him on there. Got him on that shot. And there's one more crawler up here, I think. That's still alive. Maybe, maybe not. Nope, guess not. So you want to do a head count again. You want to make sure there's four alive. And you want to fill up your ammo. There's more railgun ammo right here. And there's some DMR right there. Just hanging out. Nope, got to reload. And there's actually a, uh, you gotta go get your two marines. That's why I went down there. I cut out the video. I went to, uh, get my two marines back and, uh, make sure they're all up here. And I actually went past them and apparently they like warped to this position, but you want to make sure that they're here before you activate the button over here because, uh, you don't want them walking up this section when a bunch of enemies are spawning in this section because that would be disastrous. You want to make sure all six are up here. The two from the beginning will finally move forward, uh, once... You're up here, and then the four that were in this section. So you want to make sure six are up here. Put Cortana in here. Run down here, and we're going to do some heavy lifting. Deploy your sentry if you want. Assassinate this guy. He always spawns there. Followed by this guy spawning right here. Um, he's distracted for some reason. He doesn't turn on you right away, which is weird. It gives you a little bit of time to get over there. And you want to make sure you go over there for that third one that will spawn in and then just kill all the crawlers uh, this isn't hundred percent necessary but it makes it go way quicker and it's way more likely that you will succeed uh, if you have all six Marines up there on the turrets it's really tough for uh, any of the Marines to die they have a really good uh, stronghold up there but you might as well help them out the fourth Promethean Knight will spawn there eventually once you kill enough crawlers and then you want to head down here and once you kill more crawlers, this watcher will come in. 
You want to kill him before he spawns in even more crawlers. That way you minimize the amount of enemies you have to kill. And then you want to come over here once you kill that Watcher. And another fifth Promethean Knight will spawn. And once you kill that Promethean Knight, that cues this next one to spawn. So jump on this rock and he'll spawn right in front of you here. And any moment, there he is. Smack him. And you can run up here. And uh, count your dudes. Two, two, and... Oh wait, one, three, two... One of them decided to go... It's, they're usually split up 2-2-2, two, two, and two, but... They're doing a 1-2-3 on me. Confusing me. So grab Cortana from there, and it should pop right here as that door opens. I forgot there's three more crawlers that come up, but apparently you don't need to kill those guys. And that's it, guys. Uh, fairly straightforward. It may take a couple tries, obviously, and you may have to revert to your last checkpoint uh, a couple times just to, you know, get a feel for it and everything. But that's it. Thanks for watching. Click like and subscribe. Leave a comment. Follow me on Twitter at Halo Completion, and I'll see you later for more achievements.